yo yo hello what's up guys welcome back to my youtube channel this is kwame forest and in today's video i'm gonna share with you how i've analyzed gold and how i'm going to trade gold nasdaq and then us 30 this week okay so if you are new here don't forget to subscribe to this channel and then put on notification bell so that whenever i upload a video like this you will get notified okay so without wasting much of your time let's dive into my screen and then let me show you how i'm gonna trade this gold nasdaq and then us 30 this week okay so make sure you watch this video to the end and then you know how these pairs are gonna move this week okay so let's dive into the video so welcome back on my screen right here so this is gold and this is hot i'm expecting on gold for this week okay so let's do it quickly and then let me analyze it for you to see how gold is going to move this week okay so guys as you can see gold is trending downwards okay um currently here this is a daily time frame and then when you draw this um trend line to the downside like this you can see that you can see it clearly that gold is trending downwards okay gold is really trending downwards okay currently so this is what we are going to do this week okay trading gold so this week i'm expecting more sales on gold okay because um as we can see this zone right here this support and resistance zone right here at the same time it is a level of psychological level which is 1930 okay and then price have been breaking this zone right here this support and resistance zone here and then retested okay and then at, at the same time it has retested on this trend line for the second time or if i draw this trend line very properly i can see that this is the third time that the trend line have been touched right here and then i'm expecting more sales on gold this week guys so this is how gold is gonna gold is gonna move i want this video to be very 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 simple to you guys okay so let's move on to um lower time frame this um four hour time frame so let's move on to one hour time frame and then see how gold is going to perform this week okay so as i told you earlier we have break and then retested this zone so this hot we are going to expect more on gold this week okay so guys don't don't be confused here don't be confused here as you can see on one hour time frame you can see it clearly that um our zone have been broken and retested and gold is um selling when immediately gold retested at this zone it started selling okay on friday so this is what i'm going to do this week i'm when the market opens i'm going to sit on my hands patiently to wait for um gold to come to this zone again and then retested this zone um for the second time to create some double top right here so that i'll look for my entries and then go for short this week okay so this gold and then let's move on to nasdaq and then us 30 also okay nasdaq and this how nasdaq is moving nasdaq is in uptrend okay and then we have our zones right here we have our support and then resistance zones in the market as i have marked them quality right here okay so as you can see right now the market has been moved to this resistance zone right here and then immediately the market entered this zone the market started to sell okay massively as you can see the um the sell was very 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 massive okay on here when the market came to this resistance zone again the market sold here on friday okay so this what i'm expecting on um nas hundred this week okay this is what i'm expecting on nas hundred this week since we are in uptrend i'm expecting um nas hundred to uh, go long from here to the um, resistance zone again and then sell massively again or my second bias is um if if um nas hundred didn't respect this setup from buying here um this is what i'm expecting again as you can see we have a minor 
support and resistance zone also right here so um it has touched it and also on our trend line so if this trend line and then this support minor support and resistance break to the downside i'm going to look for sales to this support zone right here okay so this is also nasdaq and as you can see this is very very easy and simple to approach this market on this week okay so make sure you watch this very carefully so that you know the movement of nasdaq and then you trade it how i'm going to trade it or you can also trade it how you want okay so let's move on to us 30 also as us 30 and nasdaq move um sometimes they move as they move the same so um i'm going to do the same thing on nas uh, us 30 sorry i'm going to do the same thing on us 30 okay so let's go to us 30 also okay guys so this is also us 30 and this is how i'm going to trade it as you can see um on friday i caught this trade on us 30 and i'm expecting us 30 to come all the way to this zone right here before i go on long for this us 30 guys so this is amazing this country how i analyze my chart as you can see we have my support resistance zone and then my trend line also to identify the trending market that i'm currently in so this us 30 is also moving in uptrend and we are in uptrend right now okay as you can see so i'm expecting when the market open this week i'm expecting um, nas uh, sorry us 30 to come to this zone right here and then look for confirmation and then long it very 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 nicely okay so this is how i've been analyzed these pairs these three pairs that i trade and this is how i'm going to trade them this week okay please if you like this kind of content right here make sure you like and then please don't forget to like like just like and then leave your comment in the comment section and then see you again in my next video peace out